Security Level 3, Item Number, SCP-4897, Object Class, Euclid, Special Containment Procedures. Both instances of SCP-4897 are held within a double-sized K-9 containment unit at Secure Bunker 38. This containment unit is to be furnished with two large dark beds, two raised food dishes, and water bowls and attention-intensive toys such as large beef bones. SCP-4897-1 and 2 are to be individually fed 800 grams of K-9 Supplement 3B daily. Due to persistent drill production, provided water is to be changed two to three times daily. Foundation personnel amenable to canines and who have scored at least an eight on the animal empathy test, are to be scheduled to provide physical contact and playful engagement for both instances of SCP-4897 for a minimum of 120 minutes per day. The upper limit of assigned time is at the discretion of the research director. Description SCP-4897-1 and 2 are male St. Bernard's, which both measured approximately 80 centimeters from floor to shoulder, and which both have an approximate mass of 95 kilograms. Externally, neither instance of SCP-4897 presents any anomalous properties other than significantly delayed aging. However, examination of either object's interior revealed a spherical assembly of plutonium-239, estimated at 15 kilograms in mass, taking the place of the heart. When under sufficient duress, instances of SCP-4897 demonstrate the ability to spontaneously implode or otherwise undergo rapid paraphysical compression. This action is believed to involve perfect ignition symmetry, such that the mass of plutonium becomes critical and produces a nuclear detonation. Discovery Log 4897-1 With the assistance of PRI 406213, Foundation personnel were alerted to a decommissioned subterranean weapons development site due east of Point Lay, Alaska, USA. A reconnaissance team was dispatched from Site 17 to perform an initial evaluation and threat assessment. Upon gaining access to the test site, Personnel established communications through the use of on-site equipment and began a transfer of available local data. Analysis of diagnostics concluded the site still hosts three Good Boy class warheads, all of which were listed as armed and operational. Further aggress into the interior of the facility revealed a large regimentary containment cell that housed three St. Bernard's of comparable height, weight, of a generally friendly disposition. Reconnaissance team personnel were then able to secure the animals and call for extraction. Incident 4897-2 Initial containment for instances of SCP-4897-1, 2, and 3 was carried out separately due to the constraints imposed by both the size of the anonymous objects and the physical dimensions of the elevator. As such, SCP-4897-1 was extracted first by the team's commanding field agent. SCP-4897-2 was moved second, and during its absence, SCP-4897-3 became physically distressed due to isolation from its counterparts, Personnel attending to SCP-4897-3 were unable to de-escalate the situation and all communication between the remaining members of the reconnaissance team and the extraction team was lost. Shortly thereafter, significant seismic activity was detected and Foundation monitoring equipment alerted to the detonation of a nuclear device. The extraction team was immediately recalled for debriefing. Researchers note, Due to the inherent risks with separating the last two instances of SCP-4897, containment procedures have been updated such that these two should share location to promote mutual well-being. 
The increased risk is minimal, as one nuke on top of the other is hardly worse for any Foundation assets present. Having said that, these two are to be stored in a secure bunker far away from any larger sites or population centers. Addendum 48973 Synopsis The following is an interview with POI 4213 wherein he provides additional intelligence, which may be of use to the Foundation. Unrelated and extraneous audio and video have been cut. Begin recording. Let's double back to the canine bombs you mentioned earlier. How do those work? Also simple physics. Do you need another diagram? What is a doctor even in? I was hoping you could explain why dogs. Find very special housing for big payload. Soft, good-natured big dog. Inefficient cooling. But this is okay in the north. How many of these weapons does your program currently maintain? Neat. Not weapons. They're all good boys. Good boys. Da. End recording.